Hello, I am Dr. Kaiser Raja. I am a Chief Hepatologist here at Aster Hospital in Mankur, Dubai. I am part of the Aster Integrated Liver Care Team. Today I am going to tell you something about liver cirrhosis. While some of you might have heard of this word cirrhosis, it's not a very common word used in, in the lay people. Liver cirrhosis is actually an advanced form of liver disease in which the liver has got scarring. Something has been damaging the liver and over a period of years, which might be 10 to 20 years, the liver has got damaged to an extent that it has got scarred and it's not functioning well. So what causes liver cirrhosis? Almost everything which affects the liver, for example, excess alcohol use or diabetes or fatty liver or chronic viral infections of the liver like hepatitis B and C and sometimes certain metabolic problems like excess copper, excess iron in the liver or certain diseases called autoimmune liver disease in which the own, our own body attacks the liver. All these diseases in the end cause liver cirrhosis. So what is important to understand is that liver cirrhosis is the end result of chronic ongoing damage to the liver. And while the damage is going on, a person may not have any symptom because initially the liver has got extensive reserve. Only when 70 to 80 percent of the liver is damaged, a person starts feeling symptoms of liver disease and liver cirrhosis. So what happens when a person develops liver cirrhosis, especially advanced cirrhosis? A patient can feel fatigue and tiredness, loss of appetite, loss of weight, generalized weakness, and can develop advanced symptoms like mild swelling in the legs, collection of water in the tummy, or even feel yellow eyes, what we call jaundice. Many people will continue to disregard these symptoms because symptoms might be mild. But in case you have a problem which you think can lead to liver cirrhosis, for example, in case you drink excess alcohol, or you're suffering from fatty liver disease, or you're suffering from diabetes and liver disease, or you have hepatitis B and C, then you must get assessed from a liver specialist and assess whether you are at risk of liver cirrhosis. Liver cirrhosis can be detected by doing certain special scans of the liver called fibroscan and certain blood tests uh, can help in detecting the severity of liver damage. Liver cirrhosis, if detected early, can still be treated. The cause of liver disease can be treated and further progression of liver cirrhosis can be prevented. But when you have advanced liver cirrhosis with symptoms such as accumulation of fluid in the body or development of jaundice, sometimes it may not be possible to treat and reverse the liver disease. In such cases, patients are counseled and some patients will benefit from a liver transplant. You are welcome to consult us at Astro Hospital in Mankul. I'm Dr. Kaiser Raja, the Chief Hepatologist here, and we'll be more than happy to tell you more about liver cirrhosis. Thank you so much.